All right, so that was Prime Minister Modi speaking in Jharkhand. But as of now, we're shifting focus to some breaking news that's coming in. And this is regarding the Prajwal Rivanna sex scandal case. Now, SIT has arrived at Prajwal Rivanna's residence in Hassan to conduct a spot mahazar. Uh, the SIT is accompanied by local police officials. In fact, uh, HD Rivanna's wife, Bhavani Rivanna, is present at the residence at this moment. But this is the latest update that is coming in as far as the Prajwal Rivanna sex video scandal case is concerned. The latest update that is coming in is that the SIT has arrived at Rajwal Rivana's residence in Hassan in Karnataka to conduct a spot mahazar and uh, the uh, special investigation team is accompanied by the local police officials also and uh, HT Rivana's wife Bhavani Rivana is uh, present at the residence where the SIT team has arrived for the investigation. Remember Prajwal Rivana uh, is not in India, he is in Germany but uh, the SIT has been calling the father and the son for the inquiry, for the uh, investigation. Uh, they haven't turned up uh, as of now, but the latest update that is coming in is that the SIT has now arrived at Prashwal Rivanna's residence in Hassan to conduct a spot mazar and uh, the SIT team is accompanied by the local police officials. In fact, what we're also learning is that HT Rivanna's wife Bhavani Rivanna is present at the residence where the SIT team has arrived to conduct spot mazar. And CNN News 18 Sakshara is now joining us with more details on this. Akshara, what more details do we have? The SIT team has arrived at Prajwal Ravana's residence to conduct investigation. Uh, what do you see? The SIT team uh, earlier was in Hassan. Uh, they conducted the spot march at Alaw with the victim chapter. Uh, HD Ravana's residence. Now remember that HD Ravana's residence for the victim and also Ali Chakta was in the arrest here. And after that, there is an empty official residence of Prajwal Ravana in Hassan as well. So right now the SIT officials are on, already on the way uh, to ensure that they conduct a spot march that we allow with the victim. So yes, uh, both that is the of the uh, Ravana and now with the uh, uh, Prajwal Ravana process as well, spot march that is uh, being conducted. Uh, and uh, remember, this is the uh, difficulty to see here, the victims of that now, they're working with the office, they're working with the house help and make and uh, so it's a good thing. So they were, uh, you know, uh, it's going to be harassed and they can still be when it comes to the second case of Ashley uh, Ringwanda, he has been accused of uh, kidnapping and abducting one of the victims as well uh, to ensure that the statement is not given. That case has been declared at the Mysore Police Station. At least today, Ashley Ringwanda is trying to get an anti-state rebellion regarding this case and uh, the hearing is likely to take place at around 3 p.m. So last week, uh, we will watch how things will pan out. So yes, as of the as of, uh, as of for the latest details regarding this is the SOT team which has been formed in all case of uh, the Paraguay Devana and SP Devana team as well. They are conducting for March to Nathan, both of both of the restaurants of SP Devana and House and Paraguay Devana. All right, Akshara, please stay with us. We're getting some more inputs on the story. And Rahul Gandhi has now written to Karnataka Chief Minister Sidra Maya on the Prajwal Rivanna case, urging Chief Minister to extend support to all the victims and ensure that all parties responsible for this brought to book. So this is also the latest update that is coming in as far as the Prajwal Rivanna sex video scandal case is concerned that Rahul Gandhi has now stepped into this matter and he has written to Chief Minister Sidra Maya uh, urging the CM to extend all kind of support to the victims and ensure swift action. Akshara, my colleague, stays with us to give us more details on this. Akshara, uh, tell us more about the letter that has been written by Rahul Gandhi to Chief Minister Sidra Maya. Well, uh, just this side of the first three elections, uh, Rahul Gandhi has made clear that, you know, he has written a letter to Chief Minister Sidramaya. Uh, he acknowledges the fact that, you know, the, it's good that SIT has been formed and also all the investigation is taking place uh, in order to ensure that uh, the swift justice is brought to uh, book. So, uh, at the very same time, at the very end of the letter, he also mentions the fact that, you know, all the uh, all those victims who have suffered and, uh, you know, injustice has been meted out to them, they must be given proper assistance, proper protection, the required protection uh, must be given to them. So, that's what uh, Rahul Gandhi has requested the Karnataka Chief Minister Sidramaya regarding his own case. And at the very same time, the political war of words 
also continuing in his letter. Rahul Gandhi clearly mentions that, uh, uh, you know, because of the Prime Minister and the Home Minister's uh, blessings, uh, that's the reason why uh, his JDS Alliance partner leader uh, Prachal Devan has gone ahead and conducted, uh, you know, has indulged himself, uh, himself in such acts. Uh, is what uh, Rahul Gandhi is mentioning. So, yes, I uh, know uh, Rahul Gandhi has written a letter and he clearly mentions the fact that the uh, necessary protection must be given by the state government uh, and also to ensure, try to ensure that the SIT, uh, you know, conducts the uh, investigation in a fast manner to ensure a swift justice to all the victims. So, these are the contents of letter and as you know, uh, you know, this whole incident has taken a political turn with the Congress blaming the JDS along with the BJP, their alliance partner regarding the whole issue and at the very same time you heard the Home Minister respond to this case stating that it's the Congress government who should have taken necessary steps to ensure that he doesn't escape from Karnataka to abroad. So, that's the, the update regarding the political, uh, the political uh, you know, uh, developments regarding this whole Prajwal Rivana case. Uh, uh, so, yes, well, right now uh, Rahul Gandhi has written a letter to Sidramaya to ensure the swift justice along with the protection, the necessary protection that is required for all the victims.